Yeah. Welcome back to a new video. Today is Monday, October the 28th. Welcome back to another week of my life. It's right around 9.30 right now. I'm making my way over to the Ion station. I'm gonna be taking the train over to class. Later today I have to finish up one of my reports and finish off that 3,000 word essay that's due at midnight tonight. So I'll see you guys along with me for that. Uh, yeah, I'm just walking to the station right now and I'll update you guys in a bit. p.m. now got back from class got a little bit of coffee made and then I finished my essay I wrote just about 3,000 words for this essay it's due today at midnight so I just handed it in I feel a lot better now so I'm gonna make some food and then I have another assignment I need to finish by midnight tonight and then I'll probably work on editing the last video that's hopefully out by the time this one is out and I think that'll be the rest of my night. If I do have some time, I'm gonna be working on some startup stuff as well. I'm gonna be planning a meeting on Wednesday for someone from the university. They have a background with robotics. Hopefully we'll get a consultation in later this week. We do have a couple of questions that we would like to have answered, so we'll see how that goes. But yeah, I think that's gonna be the rest of the night. Welcome back guys, it's now Tuesday. I'm just about to head out the door. I'm going to a startup workshop session hosted by Waterloo Velocity on campus. I do have a startup work session later tonight followed by a volleyball game, so come along. All right, just finished up the session at Velocity. It went pretty well. I got some time to look through some of the existing patents for similar technology online and got the opportunity to talk to one of Velocity's mentors for about an hour, took a lot of really good notes. It was really cool listening to some of his experiences and he's been coaching some other Velocity startup companies. So hearing about their experience, some of their challenges and how it's all super applicable to what we're doing. But I am hungry and I just stopped by one of the best grocery stores here in Waterloo called Vincenzo's. I'm gonna go in and get a steak to make for dinner. After dinner, I have a work session that starts at seven. So I'll be going over to my friend New Shop's place for that. We might be going on to campus for some sensor testing. And then I have a volleyball game later on at nine that I'll hopefully try to record as well. So I'm going inside the grocery store now and I'll bring the camera along, show you guys what it looks like. Wednesday now, just walking over to the train station again. I released the first YouTube video last night actually. I spent maybe four days editing it. Definitely did a lot of things for the first time like color grading and working with the audio was a lot of work. So a lot of lessons learned and I think next time it'll be a lot easier and hopefully we'll be able to get this one out by Wednesday as well. It's 
It's nice being back here. I was going to the gym pretty consistently when school started back up, but I kind of fell out of the habit when things started to get busy with the startup and then with school and projects and stuff. So it's nice to be back. Part of the motivation behind starting YouTube is to try to keep myself accountable for some of the habits that I want to build. And one of those habits is definitely going to the gym. Today's going to be back and biceps. If you guys watched last week's vlog, I mentioned at the end of the video that one of my friends from my internship at Rivian was coming to visit. I was able to record a couple of clips for you guys, so here's a quick look at our weekend in downtown Toronto. Saturday morning now. One of my friends is having a birthday celebration later today, so I'm gonna be going out getting some snacks and some drinks, and I'll take you guys along with me for that. Like I was saying, Monday is my friend New Shop's birthday. New Shop is definitely one of my best friends. I've known him since grade nine and we've been lucky enough to end up coming to the same school here at Waterloo. And um, we've also been lucky to stay on stream with all the different school and co-ops that we've had. Uh, really looking forward to celebrating with him. All right, here at the grocery store now. I gotta get some pop and some chips for today. So I just got back home, but one thing that I did forget to get was a cake. Let's head back out. So we're looking to get a cake that's chocolatey, but not too sweet. So we'll see if we can find something that, that fits that description. 
One thing that I also need to get is are some candles. The shop's turning 22 on Monday, so we gotta get two of those number two candles for them. Just parked the car outside of Vincenzo's now. Ever since I started vlogging or trying to record my life here in Waterloo, I've been super hesitant to walk around with my camera out and talk to you guys out in public. I don't know, it's just not something that comes super natural to me, but I'm gonna take you guys inside Vincenzo's and I'm gonna practice actually recording myself in public. Yes. cake um, something I haven't told the vlog yet is that I actually don't eat dairy or gluten so I haven't had a slice of cake in probably almost two years so I don't know if I'm the best person to be choosing what kind of cake we eat because <laughs> I don't really eat cake and I, I don't really eat icing or anything like that I got I think black forest Italian um, I don't really know what's in a Black Forest Italian cake, but I'm hoping it'll be good. They all kind of look the same to me. They all look good, so um, hopefully it'll work out. But hopefully you guys did get to see inside the store a little bit. It's definitely one of the more, it's definitely one of the more like boutique grocery stores or markets. Um, I think a lot of people get their sandwiches. But yeah. All good, got the cake, got the candles. I'm happy they had it. They had both of them in that one location or else I would have had to go to the dollar store. So happy for that. Gonna go back home now. It's 5 p.m. right now and I think we're gonna meet closer to nine. So we'll see. I might go to campus, get a little bit of work done before that. But um, yeah, driving home now. Chicken back in with you guys. It's now Sunday evening. It's around 7.30 right now, and I'm headed to the last intramural Frisbee game. I think we are five and one, or four and one, up until now. And yeah, it's super cold outside. I think it's near freezing, and there's wind. So we'll see how it goes. I'm dressed very, very warmly, and hopefully it'll be a competitive game. I think I heard from one of the teammates that this team hasn't won yet, so we'll see how competitive it ends up being when we get there, but I don't think I'm gonna have a cameraman for this game. Try to get as many clips as I can. I'm driving over to Icon right now to pick up my friend Afraz, and then we're off to the game. Wins? What's up, vlog? Just got back home from Frisbee. It was so, so cold out and so windy, but we ended up winning. I think this is the perfect place to end the vlog. I wanna thank you guys so much for watching. We're staying consistent. This is gonna be the second upload in two weeks. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching to the very end. Please like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next week.